All right, how's everybody doing today? Hope y'all are all having a great morning. Um, so, Cyrax is back. Not really surprised. He's had internet this whole time. Um, for those that haven't kept up, he had his supposedly had an ultimatum give, given to his grandmother by his landlord over all of the property damage and harassment that uh, the landlord had been receiving in relation to his online presence. But um, he's back in this video. And it's sort of interesting. The first part, he, he's actually honest for the first time and God knows when about his, his current situation. But again, take it with a grain of salt. He's never fully honest. He, he's always got a an ulterior motive at play. But... Um, He's back because Music Biz Marty had an epic stream last night, and I'm gonna um, I'm doing this in reverse order on purpose. I want to. I think Cyrax's response is not as interesting as what Marty did, so I'm gonna put that out later. Plus, that's gonna take a little more time to do. But um, let's get into this. What's up, guys? Metal Cormania here. Um, I'm just going to be on for very long because I run the risk of uh, my family getting thrown out. I need everyone's help. People say that I'm the strong person for surviving through all this shit, but I'm really not. I'm not strong. I've been fighting to keep my head above water the whole time. And I just, I can't do it anymore. Mentally, I am fucking drained. I'm done. Mentally, I am fucking drained. I am mentally drained. I'm physically getting sick again because of stress. Yesterday I threw up twice from stress. These people are committing crimes and the police are not doing anything to help. I mean, I guess technically what what Marty did last night was a crime, but it's also one with no damage. Um, and it is nothing but funny. Um, so Marty was able to call into Spectrum and add on a gay porn package, some um, different sports packages onto a Spectrum bill. And... He did all of that because he was given all of Sally's account information. Woohoo! Someone gave it to him. Uh, I I thought it was hilarious. That that was that was an amazing stream last night. And uh, there's there's a, a video of Cyrax reacting to it, and I'll <laughs> I'll definitely be sure to share that with you guys. And it's destroying me. It's destroying my family. These people that are doing all this to me and have been doing this to me for years are committing crimes. They're committing felony and federal crimes. And they don't even care. The police don't care. FBI doesn't care. I'm tired of putting on a fucking mask. Showing that I'm okay when I'm not okay. I'm far from okay. I'm 32 years old. I shouldn't have to deal with this. I'm 32 fucking years old. I should not be having to go through this. I should be living my life 
and having fun. But I can't. Because of these people. And I don't know what to do anymore. I don't know what to do anymore. Yeah, uh, I think Rax is on here doing this because uh, Michael Hacking is back in the picture. Michael Hacking, uh, there's a phone call that he had. Marty was in on it too, which is, I, I thought, epic. I'm not usually not a huge fan of the Michael Hacking uh, bits, but Michael Hacking was really good in this last bit. Uh, definitely, in my opinion, one of his better bits, at least from recent memory. Um but Michael Hacking was telling him not to go on and attack Marty, not to go on panels and, and be rude, this and that. And my, I'm assuming Michael Hacking gave him instructions to come on here and pretend like he's cowering in fear. Uh, th this is a truly, truly a, a, a nice turnaround. Thank you, Michael, for bringing the, the, the goblin back to YouTube. People think that kicking them off of YouTube is going to do any good. No, it's not. They'll just make a new account and start right back up. Or they'll change their IP address and start right back up. suicidal ideations, but I did not act on them. I did not act. Because I didn't act on my ideations because I knew it was wrong. People think that the internet isn't real life, but it very much is real life. It really is. I don't know how to battle this anymore. I really don't. I don't know how to face this. I don't know how to fight this. I mean, everyone knows the only way you can deal with this, Rex, is uh, moving out of Sally's house, getting a job, and uh, staying off the internet. You know, that, that's something you refuse to do, though. You, you're violating what you're supposed to be doing right now because Michael Hacking has been talking to you and because Marty made some purchases that can just be refunded on a, on a Spectrum account. No, nothing bad's actually happened to you this time. Um, Marty just got a funny phone call and I'm not, I'm not sure if Marty could be charged with anything for that because he had all the account details and they were given to him. So I'm not sure how that would work, but uh, I know for sure Spe Spectrum can't fold you for, for stuff you didn't pay for. So th this is really harmless. Um, I think it's hilarious. Uh, <laughs> but uh, good old Raxy boy at his finest. I 
I know I'm taking a risk by being on here. But dude, my family needs fucking help. My family needs help. And that we have no money for a lawyer. The police want help. I don't know what to do anymore, guys. I can't do this no more. I can't. I try to fight it. I try to run from it. But nothing works. And I need help. I mean, yeah, I totally agree. You need help. You need to be taken to a, a shrink and uh, get put on some um, different medication. Whatever Sally's been drugging with you with isn't working very well. You need a probably an inpatient stay at a a, a psych ward. To be honest with you, Cyrax, that's that's what you need, dude. And then after that, hopefully, you have some semblance of sanity and you can stay off the internet. That's what you need. And why in God's name are you uh, answering the phone for, for internet trolls? Michael Hackney, he's a, you know, he's a unique troll, but he's still a troll. Uh, he's got the buddy troll thing down pretty good. I got to give him that. He's like the only one uh, that I, I can name off the top of my head that's really got the buddy troll thing down. And, uh, but, uh, you know, stay off the fucking internet, Cyrex. Go see a, a fucking psychologist. I seriously need fucking help, guys. Because I don't want anyone else to go through what I fucking went through. And what I currently go through. Just because I have a name to myself, I don't. I have a shitty life. Yeah, I, I don't know who or how he gets the idea. People think he has a great life. He lives in a $20,000 shack in, in the attic because he, he lives with his grandma. And his grandma gets taken for a ride on rent. You know, they're paying three times at least what rent should be. Uh, nobody thinks he's, he's got a good life. He, he's it's just his life is full of poor decisions and uh, mismanaged money and uh, a lack of uh, grasp on reality. Nobody thinks you've got a good life, dude, especially with those looks. You look like the fucking goblin from Lord of the Rings. Uh, you got a terrible life, dude, and you keep going on the Internet anyway. Uh <laughs> That's pathetic. I really do. And my life is crap because of all the people that have attacked me. And continue to attack me and my family and my friends. Just the other day I lost my friendship with my best friend of 17 years, Jake. And it's all because of these fucking people. And I don't know how to fight it anymore, guys. I don't. I'm tired of fighting. I can't do it no more. I'm done.
I can't fight no more. In the past week, I've slept maybe only a handful of hours. The rest of the time, I've been up non-stop. I've slept maybe 40 odd hours this whole week. Because I've had to be up to protect our house. To make sure that it's okay. To make sure that nothing gets stolen. another delusion of the racks 40 hours in a week it's more than i get sometimes you know when you got stuff to do you don't always get a lot of sleep but this could you know mark the beginning of a new cyrax uh uh psychosis uh 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 saga this would be quite interesting if sally doesn't get him uh to go see a, a shrink and he keeps this up he's he might go full-blown psychosis Michael Hack is clearly doing a great job with the racks. <laughs> and even when I do sleep, it's very little. All I want is my fucking life back that I've had stolen away from me. is my fucking life back that I had stolen from me and to stop being attacked and bullied every fucking day. That's all I have. Someone don't further notice, guys. I'm sorry, but I'm retiring as a streamer until further notice. Until all this shit gets dealt with, I'm retiring. <laughs> that's it uh tyrax thinks he's gonna retire from streaming i don't know what that even fucking means because uh that is the life he wants to return to <laughs> i don't know <laughs> uh, but you know i'm glad to see michael hacking's back um i will definitely be bringing you guys the marty and hacking calls later today if not today, then, then uh, I'll try to have them out by tomorrow morning. But I'm thinking by this afternoon, it's going to take a little more time for me to get through. They're pretty long. But um, <laughs> have a great day.